got engaged. <laughs> Here's how it all went down. Tyler. Tyler was over there in the corner watching me. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Who are you getting engaged to? So I was not expecting a proposal that week at all because I had told Tyler that I really wanted my dad to be around because he's been in China since last January. We knew that he was going to try to come back in April, but that would be the earliest. So I thought like, oh, like the proposal will be in April the earliest. I'll have plenty of time to like shop for a cute dress to be proposed to in to like get the right shoes and everything and be more prepared. During the week, I was totally just minding my own business, just doing the usual, you know, a bit of Pilates, eating bagels, you know, journaling and all that stuff. And then... Hi. Will you bury me, Shudi? <laughs> Tyler, I'm Tyler! Will you marry me? Is this real? This is real. Hi to everyone. Hi, Tyler! I can't One use more. this footage! We can blur. When I spat in your mouth this morning, you were thinking about proposing. And when you had the matcha all over you, I was thinking about proposing. <laughs> and when you were taking a poop watching Hailey Bieber for half an hour, I was thinking about proposing. <laughs> So many times. Boy, oh crap, wolf. <laughs> I couldn't tell if this was real. I had to throw you off guard. It was the perfect proposal. Except for my outfit. Flawless. <laughs> What'd you expect? That we were both gonna be in tuxedos? Yes. <laughs> right after I said yes and we were officially engaged, I was so excited to call my family and Nobody picked up the phone. I just really wanted to talk to my parents and talk to my brother and Just tell them all the good news and to share it with them But sadly everyone was ignoring me. It was actually really funny because I texted my mom and she just wrote in class And I wrote this is very important and she wrote essentially this class is more important <laughs> And then I finally got a hold of my brother. They were in the car and they were so excited and happy for me. And we talked about it for a while. I showed them the ring. They said that they were out grocery shopping on the Cape as per usual. We called Tyler's parents. They were in the car. They said they were on their way to the Berkshires. And so we talked to them for a little bit. They were super excited and happy for us. Tyler told me to pack a bag because we were going to go to a nice hotel and that I should be prepared to be pampered and that we had an appointment at one. I guessed it was some kind of a spa treatment, maybe a massage or a facial or something like that. We got in the car and started to drive and we drove down to Wells, Maine. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
So it turns out that everyone was working all week to keep this surprise for me. 
from me. My family didn't pick up the phone because they didn't want to ruin the surprise of having my dad around. When my brother picked up the phone with Roxy, he said that he was already at the house. He and Roxy ran out. They had to get everyone to move the cars out of the way so that he could drive out of the parking lot. He just didn't want to ruin the surprise at all. Tyler's parents weren't actually on the way to the Berkshires because they were on their way to Maine. And I didn't even notice that when we FaceTimed them, their car was full of stuff, full of supplies for this party. Chad and Roxy, his girlfriend, went up to Maine the night before that Saturday and they decorated the whole house even though they were exhausted from like a full week of work and they stayed up and blew up 150 balloons and not only that, they strung them up in the most beautiful like balloon garland thing and put up all these cute decorations. They put these um, hydrangeas and tulips and these cute mason jars that Roxy decorated herself. She tied the twine around the flowers or around the mason jars. Tyler's older sister Lexi sent us Russ and Daughters bagels and locks. Oh my gosh, like it was, it was just the best day ever. Just being able to experience it with so many people that I love was the best thing in the world. I just wanted to share this video with you just to share some of the love and just magic that happened that day. I want to hold on to that feeling forever and remember it and I, I'm just really happy. I'm so excited to get married to the love of my life, Tyler. And for any of my friends out there who weren't at this party, I wish you were there and I can't wait to celebrate with you sometime soon. Hope you can take in some of this love and happiness and energy that I received this weekend. Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you next time. Bye.